Here they come from the 1,000 meter marker. Spiffy jumped a little bit outwards but is in touch a length off. Wishful words, Bequay, Madame Defarge, red sleeves and caps around them, Patagonia. Spiffy head up in the air for a stride or two. Bequay, the favourite, at the rail. Races only two lengths off them. Amber Bell, perfect Prezi, four lengths off. Further back in the running as we drop back to Fleek. Fleek's got about six, seven to make up. Watch me go. Wishful words, 400 metres out. Madame Defarge. Bequay's towards the inside. Spiffy's on the bridle. Needs a way through. Full of running. Spiffy got to get through. Madame Defarge. Wishful words gets away. Spiffy now gets to the inside and Patagonia's trying to close in. Spiffy with a rails run. Wishful words. Madame Defarge over the last hundred. Madame Defarge. Wishful words. Spiffy's on the inside. The three of them. Madame Defarge just in front as they go to the line. Madame Defarge, Spiffy unlucky second, then came wishful words. Amber Bell's further back for the minor positions. Well, Madame Defarge had first run and just keeps going. Spiffy, very unlucky in second. The gaps did not open at the right time and then just seemed to hesitate between the 100 and the 150. We'll go down that long neck. Wishful words. Amber Bell. Fleek. Minor positions. Watch me go. Perfect Prezi. Bequay, no extra. Spiffy's had to go right toward the inside, had her ground to make up. Bequay's come under pressure. Madame Defarge, red sleeves and cap. Wishful words, the blue cap. And Spiffy's at the rail, coming home stoutly late on. But number one, Madame Defarge at 12.30, lasting just long enough. Spiffy's on the left-hand side as they go past the post. Race one, back to the studio. Well, Madame Defarge has won the first race today for Patrick Nunny's friends and uh, Nail Tovey. We're here with Patrick. Pat, well done. Yeah, won a good race. Oh, thanks so much. Yeah, I just bought her from the Shongwini sale as well. And uh, she's had three runs for us. She ran f two 1400s. And 1200 last time she over raced. So I said to Keegan, what do you think? Run out of five. He said, no problem. So we put her back in the five, give her a bit of a chance. But she jumped out well and she was up second. And she held on. Yeah. Yeah. You got any more runners? No, I finished for the day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well done. Yeah. I'd like to thank uh, Neil as well as coming to share in the filly. And um, to Jessica who helped me. I was away at, uh, last, week, last week at Kruger and she stood in for me and she did really good work at Stables. Well done. And to World Sports Betting, my sponsor. Thanks. Lovely. Now, come and have a chat before the jock gets here. <laughs> this is a quick return. Yeah, this was great. Uh, I thought it was really a week too early, a week or two too early. We thought 1,000 would be a little bit sharp. But i also like to just acknowledge Mervyn and Lionel. Yeah. yeah, Mervyn has a good eye for horses yeah, and finds uh, he finds them. And yeah, uh, yeah great. Uh, it was a big surprise. Uh, wonderful start to the evening. Any more runners? No. no. You've got any left? No. <laughs> well done. Lionel. Yeah, thanks very much. Thank you. Well done, Keegan. Will the far furlong work, don't eh? 100% was left. Uh, I jumped off the last time and I said, please run this filly over far furlong and uh, yeah she won nicely today she didn't beat much but uh, she had a bad draw to contend with so um, it was a full uh, win full of merit how's the rest of your card look i got a couple chances i think you know it's it's tough racing but i do think script right is probably my next best uh, he does have a wide draw to contend with but yeah I, I do think he's my next best thanks for your help thank you very much to um the whole land family you know jess was doing a lot of work while um, mr land and his family were away so well done to her for keeping the stable going and uh, to the winning guys thank you very much well done thank you there we go, Keegan Demello, top rider. He's produced the goods. And uh, Madame Defarge has won a well done to Rose Dean Stud. They bred the sauce, and uh, Pat's done a wonderful job, got it sprinting, and it's come through and broken the maidens.